Ho oh, ho ho ho. Hello, hello everybody. Today. Oh, I hope you're all doing well, first of all. Ah. Oh, that was loud. Hope everyone's doing well. Staying in sight. Today we're playing Ration Plank from the Ration Plank Collection on the PS3. I think I played a little one crunch reaction thing, but I don't remember the point. So this is like all new to me. Know what I'm in for? Good things, bad things. No. You know my Somnia game. Watchit and quank. Quick look at the options. Start the sound, sound. Yeah, that seems about right. Alright. Languages. English. Yep, that seems about right. Alright, let's do this. Play flat one. Yes, please. Excuse me. Save complete. Kaizil Plateau, Planet Belden, 11.13 a.m. Final step, attach robotic ignition system. Thank you for using help desk technology. Meanwhile, in a factory on a nearby planet. Big robot factory. Oh, it's a little clank. Is it like a mistake? Just steal that robot and run. And away we go. Approaching planet Velden, eleven forty AM. Wait the epic adventure. Right out of the gates as well. Oh, here we are. Oh, it looks like a little toaster with a head. Welcome to the Gadgetron Help Desk. We are here to offer you advice during your interplanetary travels. The help is a free service provided by Gadgetron Corporation. Nice. Alright. So, let's go towards the explosion. Give me a weird frog lizard thingamajiggers. But yeah, it's a game where I just break everything. Oh my gosh. Sounds like... <gasps> Don't fall. Sounds like Lego. Um... Anything with the studs you're collecting bolts. Did, did Lego just rip this off? Like, yeah, yeah, rip this game off and then, like, we'll just make it all little studs to collect instead of bolts. Yeah, never played this game. I remember a teeny tiny of renting one game before. It was. It had little furry blue monsters, and that was about it. That's all I remember. Oh, there's what? The greatest superhero ever. Can break those. Oh, yeah, I can break those. 
We need every bolt that we need. And get How else are we gonna buy the best gear and the best? Actually, I'm just make sure there's no stack rats. Oh, follow the trail. You can interrupt help desk messages by pressing the trolley button. To disable help desk messages, please select options from the pause menu. Go ground pound as we can. We have the power. Gadgetron's Omni-Ridge 8000 includes a new Comet Strike feature. To activate it, use the R1 button to crouch, and then press the square button. I can crouch. That's square. Oh, wall. Well. I like it. I like it. Oh. the boxes that's all you needed back in the good old days and look at Sola that hour just smashing pot that's nano whenever you sustain injury let gadgetron's patented nano pet system rebuild your body from the inside out i think i want to i, I know it's hell but Seems like what happens if I go all along? Oh, oh, hello. Don't touch me. The deal with. Not let her flip. I don't want none of it. Oh, he's gonna put it on his head. Oh, okay. Never mind. I thought I just had to, like, slam on his head. What is he doing, man? Ooh. Bomb. I just need to know where to get the bomb go. Okay. I thought that was gonna be the off path that dead ended, but apparently it's this way. Right. I collect all the bullets. Nuts. called pro strat for breaking boxes none of this one at a time business yeah got all good get out this one we can because it's not an n64 game where that face would still block you Go. Oh. Okay, I've done more damage. To use your bomb gun, press the circle button to equip and the circle button again to fire it. You can also use it in first person by holding down the L1 button. Oh, L1. <laughs> Oh, that makes it so much easier. And I can do that. Oof. Oof. That's how you do it. Oh. Ah. Give me all your innards, please, Mr. Silva. Man, looks like I'm gonna have to, like, face with the Lego games, too, because... 
I'm gonna get tired of collecting little bits after a while. Okay. This. 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 Blue blade. Oh, I think it is. Come on. There we go. Open, open for three, got two, split the difference. Come smash the strats. Oh. My new toaster. Interesting. You're quite handy with your wrench. You bet. I built that ship with it. Hmm. Currently, I'm in search of someone who could be of assistance in saving the solar system. Do you know where I might find that fellow? Well, he's on the radio every week. Other than that, no. Hey, what's with all this save the solar system stuff anyway? Hello, citizens of... No, My like... race to blog have a small problem. Our planet has become so polluted, overpopulated, and poisonous that we are no longer able to dwell here. But I, Chairman Dreck, have a solution. We are constructing a pristine new world using the choicest planetary components available. So, what does this mean to you, you might ask? Using highly sophisticated technology, which you couldn't possibly understand, we will be extracting a large portion of your planet and adding it to our new one. Unfortunately, this change in mass will cause your planet to spin out of control and drift into the sun where it will explode into a flaming ball of gas. But, of course, sacrifices must be made. <laughs> Thank you for your cooperation. And if you don't like it, you can take your whiny, sniveling, snot-nosed populations, form a line behind me, and kiss my... We're still on? Oh, turn <laughs> it off, you idiot! <laughs> the people on those planets are hosed. Well, good luck getting Captain Quark to help you. Actually, you could help me. If you could use your ship to take me to the coordinates contained in this infobot, I might be able to gather further information there. Even if I wanted to, I can't. I'm missing a crucial component of the ship. The robotic ignition system. How did you know that? I, sir, happen to be equipped with the latest in robotic ignition systems. My programming allows me to start any ship I choose. So, I agree to take you to this wherever it is, and you get my ship started for me? That is what I'm proposing. I heard just Deal. picture of the planet. That, uh, commercial. Chairman Drex flagship fell in orbit. Uh oh. This could be a problem. Take care of it. Whoa, this is great! So that's where I've been stuck this whole time. Please return your appendages to the steering mechanism, sir. Huh? Oh, right. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, and by the way, you could stop calling me, sir. The name's Ratchet. Pleased to make your acquaintance, sir. You got a name? My serial number is B54296. Oops. I'll just call you Clank for short. Hang on. Okay. Back on Chairman Jerk's flagship. So you see, it would be most beneficial if your citizens were not in the city when my workers begin removing it. Preposterous. I will not stand for this. Unfortunately, you have no choice in the matter. Let's just see what Captain Quark has to say about that, my good man. <laughs> I don't see what's so funny. Captain Quark could dispatch you without even picking a sweat, you, you puny. You have now officially worn out your welcome and my patience. This is your last chance. Stop this madness now! Okay, wait. You're right. I will withdraw my troops. Really? No! 
is all yours, gentlemen. Try not to leave any marks. Entering atmosphere of planet Novalis. Oh, oh. Uh, Clank? Where are you? Oh, sorry about that. Well, we're not leaving the way we came in. Perhaps we could procure a ship from one of the inhabitants. If there are any left. Okay, back this. Oh, that's in the game show saving button, right? Corner of the screen, your progress is saved. That Enter. Okay, um. Also, I'm. Don't kill that thing at the bottom. Get rid of that tax so much. That's why. Didn't know there was an actual you gotta save our first. Oh, it's a triangle. Or dumbass. Um, double dumbass. Sounds good. Oh, 
Yes. Funny. No money. Next spot. Closer to the town. Not painted on. Oh, wait. Hi there, fuzzball. Oh my god, Josh, I know that place. Probably. That's a real beauty. Oh, I don't. Away we came. That was convenient. Ah. Oh, goofiness. Gonna send me all the way, all the way back. Oh, no! Oh. Oh, with the grabbiness, land like I want you. Beep. Oh, oh. oh. I'll jump, apparently. That one. Around, maybe there's something up there for sure. But who knows how to get there? This way. Anything? That's like why? Wish I could move it. Okay. Let me hit some fun stuff. We got back on the rush. We started going for us all the way. Oh. Okay. Do we even want this? Apparently, I can't get it without her. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, I couldn't, couldn't pick it up even if I wanted to. I was just gonna hurt myself for no reason.
Let's try. Turn around, players. <laughs> look, plumber's crack. What did you just say? I said, look, the plumber's back. All right, wise guy. Shouldn't you be on one of them escape transports? Escape transports? Newsflash, giant robots attacking. The escape transports are taking all the rich folks off this goddamn planet. So why aren't you on one? Socioeconomic disparity. What? He hasn't got enough volts. Working people have to wait for Captain Quark to save us. Well, got anything worth a lot of bolts? I got this thing. Shows two weirdos ditching their ship. It's got coordinates to a desert planet, too. An infobot. Ratchet, we could use that. Geronimo! And we Did helped the guy. down a sewer pipe? Mayday, Mayday! This is the Solar Ship Radical. We seem to be under attack from the planet's surface. Relax, kid. It looks like some sort of fireworks display. Probably in your honor. Whoa! That was close! Ah! Pipe down, I can't concentrate! Oh, we've been hit! Uh, an unexpected detour. When we land, I'll see if I can scare up an exhibition for you. We're not gonna live that long! Kid, let's am scream! Eject! Eject! Okay, you see okay. that guy on the left? That was Skid McMarks. Does he know Captain Quark? I doubt it. He's a pro hoverboarder, always going off about how cool he is. Looks like he's in trouble. I'll say. I've never seen him look so freaked out. Kid Gadgetron McMarks. Infobots give you coordinates for new planets. Now that you have the Infobot for Planet Iridia, you'll need to find a ship to get there. All right, found to buy a ship. Find a ship. I'm tired of. Oh, no, no secret. Drop down. Go to the sewer. Oh, let me do this. Oh. I it all. Oh, wait. This is. What is that? Yeah. I got some great bargains for you today. I'm assuming this is a paint pillar.
suspicious. Speed running. Oh. oh thank you. Here we go. That's all this. All these.
these. I wonder how much the next weapon is going to be. It's probably going to be a fortune. Secrets, secrets. Yes. Team up. Yes. All right. Extra secret. No. So, go back to where you started. Suited for a certain amount of enemy, or a certain type of, enemy. and the amount to the problem. But I like the bolt thing to do too. I like the bomb, bomb globe. Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! Oh, what are you? Mercenaries? Torturers? Assassins? I I'll tell you anything. Here, take my infobot. It's all I've got left. Sir, we're not assassins. Hold on. Let's see what he's got. Has this ever happened to you? Hi, I'm Captain Quark, and believe me, there's nothing worse than stirring down a Blargy and Snaggle Beast from the inside and knowing your equipment isn't functioning properly. That's why I come to Al's Robo Shack for all my electronic needs. Al has been the exclusive repair shop for my super electro gadgets since I was knee high to a sand mouse. If Al can't fix it, it's not broke. Right, Al? <laughs> you said it, pal. So if you're fighting crime, or just fighting grime, <laughs> come to Al's RoboShack in Metropolis for all your robotic repairs. Al's RoboShack, it's cool. Sold out. No, it means Captain Quark is on Metropolis. We could tell him about this invasion. If we had a ship. <laughs> what? Uh, a, a ship? What? You're not going to torture me? Well, as planetary chairman, I could arrange for you to borrow our courier ship. Yeah, cool. perfect. You can count on us, sir. Right. Thank you, your chairman shipliness. Now that you have coordinates to two new planets, you can use your ship. Press the select button to bring up the map. Your ship is marked with a star. Okay. Planet Ardea and Erwin. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Exit. Oh. Let's go to Big Owl. 
and upgrade our weapons. Get new edible magic weapon. So we're going to the silver wet. I think it's pretty obvious who is working with um, the big evil man. interested in seeing a little water and have this little spiky thing here. That's why I'm still uh no. So that's why I left it alone. Shooting at me. Oh shit, we get the hide. Enter the ship. Two second. Oh, there we go. Easy. Um, go. Oh, crap. Hello, citizens of. And the golden screw. Locate okay, skid make mark. Find skid. Yeah, 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 I guess it's fine. Not used to controls yet. PlayStation. PlayStation 3. Perfect to back out, but it's. Currently, the except button. And it, I read. Yeah, I found him right away. That was easy. It's him, Skid McMarks. That man from the Infobot. 
In the flesh, little dude. You guys get a load of that epic space battle I was in? We saw you screaming for help. Uh, that was like a war cry. My agent and I got ambushed on the way to hoverboard practice. Did he survive the crash, sir? Yeah, he's okay. But I've had a little trouble getting back to my ship due to my sprained ankle. Oh, come on. If you can take out all the sand sharks, I just might have a spare hoverboard for you. We'd love to help you, Mr. McMarks, but Ratchet and I need to find Captain... One of your boards? Hmm. I've always wanted a decent hoverboard. Well... All right, you just keep that foot elevated. Oh yeah, right now we got some adult music. No, oh, that's just a cool. Break all the sand sharks. Oh, 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 oh. Well. There's some of going in. Just regular, your regular old water. So, uh, oh, hello. Oh no, you can't from. Up there, but help. Oh. 
go collect all these hundreds of loads. Ten more health. So that's cool. You can't even buy these. Well, I got a bail. Gets you dudes at the hoverboard races. You've just acquired a Gadgetron Z3000 hoverboard. Use your new hoverboard okay. to the racetrack in Blackwater City on Planet Railgun. Everything sounds intact inside. I don't, that was weird. It was weird. Okay. Great. Missed part where he gave us our board. Thank you, game. Perfect timing. Or it's a thank you, controller. Perfect timing. And a few little shortcuts. Hi there, fuzzball. Oh, it's not a reward for getting across this. I hope I didn't miss an important cutscene there. Find his agent. Damn it. Oh, the shirt. Too many years of Xbox and fucking anything that has the B button on the right side. You will need a Gadgetron swing shot to traverse this area. Our records indicate that the swing shot is not available on this planet. Oh, thank you, Ian. That is actually handy. 
first more games would tell each other that, but they break the bone of fate. Faster than I think I can. Did I really that low on. Oh, construction will stop. Have to pay me for the bolts of the nuts and the wooden pops. Ah, uh, too good. I hear this. The beginning. Just like over the wall, and then you... ah, ah. that is ground. Green stuff isn't what I can name. That was up there. Whatever. Run in four town. Don't okay. think. 
Bolster. Bolster. I'm sorry. One Hoverboard. You're looking at a Z3000 Deluxe Hoverboard manufactured by Gadgetron. Use it in races held throughout the galaxy. Boarding automatically equips as soon as you step onto an official Gadgetron hover track. When racing, use X to jump. You could perform tricks by jumping and pressing the combination of those buttons to try using the thing to spin while I'm there as well. Find the zoomerator and convert those tricks to purple. Oh. Oh. Well, that we know. Board have Warpus. No signal whatsoever. This downtime is killing me. Do you need medical attention, sir? Don't be so literal, son. The problem is I'm stranded on this backwater planet and my star client is nowhere to be found. Hey, we saw you on that info bot. You're Skid's agent. Was Skid's agent. I haven't seen him since our ship crashed. And an agent without a client is like a flea without a dog. Say, you look like an athletic kid. If you can bring back the championship prize from the hoverboard races in Blackwater City, I'll make you my next star. We have no time for trivial matters, sir. Hmm. I could be the next Skid McMarks. Yeah, I could be, but McStain. There we go. Cover board time. Ah, cover board. Also. I missed them. Maybe, maybe. Oh. This is. I'll eventually get it one of these days, folks. Book crew. Gotta find a place. If you want to impress this agent, you'll have to win a hoverboard race. The yeah. nearest hoverboard race is in Blackwater City on planet Rilgar. More games did stuff like that. Like, really, I wish more games did stuff like that. That would have been wasting more time trying to. Like find a race. Maybe, maybe. One of these days. Oh, there you go. Go Metropolis. Or one. Let's stop. Child Robo Chair. I'm burning in a fire. Furious Bozak.
Hi there, fuzzball. Up in the history. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, I can probably buy more. Okay. This is what I thought I would do. And pork. No, oh, never mind. Welcome to the Captain Quark Fitness Course. If you're strong enough, fast enough, and clever enough to beat my fitness challenge, you will receive a reward from my head trainer. Simply make your way to the third island to complete the course. Good luck. Quark Enterprises is not responsible for sprains, broken bones, snapped tendons, bruised egos, or accidental death incurred while taking the challenge. Excuse me, Captain, but we have more pressing issues. We urgently need your assistance. Clank? Yes? Do you notice anything unusual about Captain Quark? Well, I find the fact that he has a spring where his legs should be to be quite puzzling. And why do you think that is? Possibly an injury incurred while battling evil? This isn't the real Captain Quark, you numbskull. It's a robot. Oh. Can't bring it. That's right, fitness fans. Just oh, okay. Double jump eight. Don't know why. Thank you. These moving walls also function as jump spots. Jump and jump again to kick off the walls in mid air until you reach the top. Pretty high up. Oh, I got a trick. of the heights. What do you mean? 
We finished the circuit, ma'am. Oh, yeah, but it is weak. Weak, weak! When I was competing, I would devour courses like that for breakfast! <laughs> Bet that's not all. If it were up to me, you would drill, drill, drill for the rest of the day! But somehow you managed to impress that fool Captain Quark! Captain Quark knows about us? He certainly does. And worst of all, he wants me to give you a prize for that ridiculous performance! Cool, what is it? I'm supposed to give you a swing shot! So you can sway to and fro like little insects! Alright, let's see it. Not so fast! Today the two of you disgraced my obstacle course, so I'm going to make you pay! But that prize is ours from the captain. That's not fair. Too bad, life's not fair. Beat her up. Sweet. I bet Captain Quark uses stuff like this all the time. Ha! Real men can swing without silly toys like that. The two of you make me sick. Oh, there she goes. Congratulations on your new Gadgetron Slingshot. Use it on standard Versa targets like the ones nearby. If the target is out of view, use the L1 button to aim. I got some great bargains for you today. Yeah, full crap all over again. No, I don't. Better have the switch out there. Yeah. 
be a really decent but I'm not running all the way back there. Get it. Here. Which is up here, I am. Maybe the long jump wouldn't work. Extra high jump. Something like that. On the infobot. Remember, he knows Captain Quark. Hey, you're that robot guy, right? No, actually, I build robots. I myself am not a robot guy, per se. <laughs> Nerd. I like him. So, now that we've cleared that up, what can I do for you? Well, we saw your infobot announcement. You were with Captain Quark. We're trying to find Captain Quark. We thought you could help us. Your logic is commendable. However, I haven't seen Captain Quark since we shot that commercial. Say... Do you run on standard XP-18 sister boards? Version 7.66. Back at ya. I may be able to help you out after all. How does a helipack upgrade sound? Upgrade? Natch, since he's a 766, I could have the little guy up and flying in no time. Ooh. Of course, uh, I'll just need my fee for service. Well, we can fly. Um, oh, it's a big robot. Big robot heads. Hope those aren't the body. Oh no, they're really bad. Alright. Okay, this won't so, hurt a bit. Hey, wait. I think all money is the same across all the world. Ratchet, am I cool now? <laughs> yeah, you the man, Clank. You're welcome. Thank you. Try using the Helipax boost jump feature to climb these boxes. Press the R1 button to crouch, then jump. You'll need your new Helipax stretch jump feature to cross this gap. While you're running, crouch using the R1 button and then jump. Oh, oh, I, that totally looked like a platform. John, all I'm gonna do is this like Press one drop the top of the bell. That is not a platform. Your stretch jump feature to cross this gap. While you're running, crouch using the R1 button and oh, then jump. Oh, oh folly. Oh folly. Try 
using the glide feature of your new helipad. Jump, and then press and hold the X button in mid-air oh, yeah. to glide. Amazing. Get out of the way. Or more for your stomach. How's it going? Yeah, I've never uh, played this game before, but it seems pretty fun. Super Slash. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty fun. I am pretty much in the beginning. I'm only played an hour and a half of this. So right now we're just going plant to planet. 
Um, I just got my swing shot. Oh, oh I got to ride the robot train. I got, I just got my helipad. Train. A nice train. Get through the fresh open air as you go and get sun. Trains of the future are very interesting. Fun game. Oh, come on, no. Come on. Four, 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 four. Mm hmm. I won't say it's too easy. I have died by being down. I feel like zooming in and in. Play all the Ratchet and Clank games. Wait, there's quite a few Ratchet and Clank in here. Gotta be at least like 12 or more. Dispense with the pleasantries, Lieutenant. My sources tell me you're behind schedule. You must prepare this planet to be harvested for our new world. Yes, sir. As you can see, everything is moving along as planned. I'm counting on you, Lieutenant. And as your former commander can tell you, I don't take disappointment well. Yes, sir. I won't fail. I love how he's like Greg is destroying yet another planet. The yeah, cigar but that's the kind of help he's getting. I don't think we have anything to worry about. You should not underestimate Chairman Drek. He is quite dangerous. We must find Captain Quark. Look, that lieutenant doesn't seem so tough. Let's take him out ourselves. Perhaps we can persuade the lieutenant to tell us where Drek is. <laughs> now you're talking. And the uh, info box. All the money. Yeah, I plan on playing a bunch of the Ratchet Clank games. I'm gonna try and play all the main story games or like the main ones that actually have game changing plot gameplay changing plot whatever you want to call it dogging your adora coming to you stop the robot lieutenant from chopping all the trees down Email board, except Chairman Drex's flagship, you rode uh, orbit. Yes, quite lovely. That should just about do it. Commander, we are finished with this world. Commence towing our planet to its next destination. Lieutenant! Yes, sir. You have fulfilled your tree quota. 
barely. We are ready to return to base. Not so fast, Lieutenant. Just because we don't need any more trees doesn't mean they should have them. Destroy everything. An asshole. It'd be destroyed anyways if it flies into the sun. But then he's just like, aha. Planet, you're old. Back with me. with the chopper. I like how we're just like automatic heroes. Saving crap. Uh, it's not too bad. It's a little snowy. Like today we had a little bit of flurries, but mostly just been a little cold. Yeah, not too bad. How about where you are? Yeah, Texas is it, it's showing up in the news where Hi there, front ball. crazy. Oh, that's a nice one. Funny. Yeah, they got buried and I saw like toilets freezing and the only fans have an ice cream coming down it. Where you might forty one eight. Wait, what's forty F? Oh, forties. I'm a derp. Which is, yeah, just like zero ish around your father. Like, for us, I think. Where freezing gets through. I gotta be a flying guy and progress. Or have the what you call it? Moon shot. Show a trespasser available on this planet. I do like how the game says you won't find the weapon you're looking for here, so don't waste time with them. Let's say that exactly. Pretty much. It's like 510 degrees. Okay, so it's not too freezing, but it gets cold. Oh. Coat on. I won't be going to bear like groups. That, that's not too bad for Florida normally. It's like the lowest they usually get, isn't it? Mission. Mission. 
Robot Lieutenant. Alright, well. I'm gonna get across this bullcrap. Or am I just gonna run? Oh, I'm a dumbass. Sorry, yesterday. So that's about like. I'm trying to do the perfect in my head, but I cannot do it right now. Hi there, Fuzzball. Love of Domes. Oh, seriously. I'm dumb, sorry. 30 is not bad. That's like. Definitely can wear a t shirt, no problem. Bring it way too hot. I'll have a Gadgetron trespasser to get past the door. Unfortunately, our scans do not show a trespasser available on this planet. It's not too bad. Funny if like if it gets or 30 gets it like if it's slightly too hot up here. People it's in the range of people who complain. Like a more majority. Everyone complains about post temperature. Even if they don't actually know like it. It's refreshing. Well, I don't know if it's similar heat down where you guys are, but up here it's more humid. Or very humid, I should say. And, um, it's just the sweaty stickiness that I hate. And a lot of people don't like. Oh, okay, these guys. They shoot a lot better. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if you guys got unity. I was hoping it'd be like what you call it. Jamaica where it's just a hot heat but not humid. I've never been to Florida. Damn, or it was stale in 90 minutes. But you gotta eat your ice cream pretty fast or no. been to a place once where it was just hot, hot heat. Uh, yeah. Not humid heat. It was the most amazing thing. But so much easier to get sunburned because you don't know. Every, I believe it. 
Also, there was a picture I saw down there, and there was fans in the hallway. Like, we don't have fans in the hallway. No building gets hot enough to need fans in the hallway. When it hits 50, you start to shiver. Dude, that's a, that's a nice average weather. Like, it's not too hot. Not as close as the cold enough. You have outside fans there. Yeah, it's never been to a place that has stuff like that. Oh, and I miss. And I gotta go to the washroom, so I'll be like two seconds. is too nice we stay inside August is god damn brutal yeah oh I imagine August is like oh man we better have like our sweaters on actually yeah we, we usually have like a nice sweater on or something outside like people sitting outside and like their like wooden chairs and so on Whoa, with wet dripping down their face wow so it's basically it gets so hot that one of those plastic spray bottle style air fresheners in your car you won't for long because the bottles will melt. Damn, that's pretty hot. Like, that's like you could fry an egg inside your car. And don't touch the buck. Seat buckle. That seat buckle is close. You'll just get freaking 10 degree burns. Actually, first degree. Car the number of both. I think. Yeah, that's pretty funny. But then at least anyway, that's not. Like, but that's crazy. But damn it, I need to stand back and just not be a dumbass. Why not try Gadgetron's Glow of Doom? This life-saving gadget lets you attack your enemies from a safe distance with tiny killer robots. Oh. So I couldn't afford that in front of the Oh, 
all things no I imagine all like what would you call it rub on stuff just you know and then water bottles from there that left in your car are so gross to drink it would get is maybe like 30 40 and like that range it's like okay there's a heat warning try to stay cool and out of the sun they might even have like dirt and stuff There. Over here. Here. Could be hot. She's <laughs> out. The friggin' water bottles. It's all you need for like instant noodles. You just put instant noodles in a like a water container in your car and come back for lunch and I'll cook for free. Yeah. Yeah, I felt like when it's too cold to go into the water first, you gotta just keep dipping real quick. Laugh this time. What? That sounds amazing. That's super. Like, God. People pay for heated pools, like up here. But it's perfect if you love swimming or any water related activity. since you like in there or it just never oh. oh isn't there a thing called El Nino that comes in maybe um is education bad government No snow here ever. Everyone would just flip out. No one owns a snow shovel. So you can never probably get out of your way. Probably worse in Texas. I don't know, well, probably depends on the people that live there and how they will react.
here. Oh my god. I can barely handle this game. Fair enough. That's how uh, a lot of people from like Toronto is south of me. By go about 80, well, 80 kilometers or 88 kilometers is where my grandfather lives. That's pretty north of Toronto still. Like it's in North York. Which is a part of Toronto, but a lot of people downtown don't consider it Toronto. But anyway, I digress. People going down Toronto when they get like, like an inch or two of snow, they all forget to drive. Like, it's amazing. So many people that are just driving and sliding and causing accidents. Getting into accidents. It's bewildering what happens. Don't have it. Oh, probably not. No insulated pipes or plows. Or safety guard. Green cars, tin car pop. Or... Yeah. Like every morning I lived in the city and snow happened, like just a little dusting. There would be like 10, wait, 5 to 10, I would say, the first hour. Right here on the drive to work. Rains for like eight months a year. Pee. That's terrible. Alright, so it doesn't ever get cold enough to smell. You just get all that rain. Only, you only get a drill in for 30 minutes. Just stay off the roads for that half an hour. Good to make it. There's nothing down here. Uh. It's like, it's like the wrong button every time. I'm trying to push four for back. Like a little hurricane. Dude. Oh wait. Greetings. The wrong button. I keep meaning to push a B like on an Xbox. <laughs> you see it rain going up. Let's have another burr. Wait for it all to dry up. Okay. Sorry. Need to be doing this a lot. That just brought me to the that. No, I keep pushing it. It's all over and all the water dries up in like 15 minutes because it's like a thousand degrees and it's just humid as fucking hell. more like snow in New York snow in New York or you'd still rather not have the snow like Florida very humidity they don't mind the cold because like you can just put on a sweater and it's all good the heat like you can only get so hot, or you can only, like, undress so much. 
Like once you're down to your skin, there's there's nothing left to do up to the fan. Okay. But you could get air conditioning. So. That's true. You don't have to shovel heat. I got some great bargains for you today. Fair enough. Like, no, uh, there's some days where I'm just like, I don't want to shovel snow. I'm just going to say, do it. But, um, there's people that, like I said, can't drive with hard snow. Like, every snow day, like the last couple days here I'm not looking for um people I've seen people in the ditches the game has spoken I go that way I push that button yeah that's true too it's just well doesn't get too much in the ice here like if you leave it, it it's just like um just a layer of snow like a really hard layer of snow but a layer of snow okay you know unfortunately our scans do not show a trespasser available on this planet that's the good but then you got the problem with the snow plow at the end of the driveway that just pushes like a big layer of snow. Oh no. I'm in. Door. Yeah. Maybe, um, maybe. This is up to Roman. Yeah, and I would imagine you guys don't get as much snow. Well, that's not true. Rochester gets a fair bit of snow sometimes. Well, they get way more snow than Toronto does across uh, Lake Ontario. I've done that. I've done all of it. Yeah. No, no, I figured you were from the city. Well, I didn't fully figure, but I figured you weren't from Rochester. I was just saying that because that's like right across where Toronto, where I used to stay. And yeah. Oh, am I supposed to be shooting these guys too? Like, I don't know. But, get a foot about six times a year. That's, that's a little fair bit. Not like a super lot. A decent amount. Turn around and get across that. Only yeah. Yeah, I three to six inches every week. Yeah, that's a little dusting. Nothing too crazy. Good.
like not like you need a big plate to have a shovel. Must have been a belt. Out every day for October first and day four. That's a nice a good amount of snow up. Like a nice steady Nice steady one where it's not just a huge dump where it's like, okay, here's about a foot and a half. Have fun. Hope you get ready because you're gonna get like another foot later in the day. So uh yeah, have fun. Oop these things, but I'm looking across. Pretty sure I can't jump on that. He didn't know I could do that. No. Oh, it's true. No stops, it's too full. So yeah, wouldn't be too bad that like, it wasn't during the day or... Oh, it was during the day, what was it? Yeah, just... Yeah, just does it later in the day till the sun goes down. For a thing, for a purpose. Game, what is it that you want here? Oh, I got a, a planet that it is. You didn't tell me to go to, but to get the weapons from one of the planets I can go to. The robot. I've been here before. Throw on your beer coats and walk to parties, anyways. Good, yeah. Like, there's been days where I've like tried to walk down blocks. Like, too snowy and too cold, and you just can't see anything. It's a blizzard. There's like a foot of snow you're walking through. You're just like, ah, oh, why did I, why did I pick this baby out? I'd love that. Yeah, go walk. I want a little. I'm only gonna snow about three inches. Three to six inches today. Assassin was at the bottom of a big hill. That really sucked. You gotta like walk up the ones knowing the weather. Yeah, all the school and stuff. Was, all the school buildings you had to go to were up at the top. Here we go. Got it. We've heard it out. 
Oh, please make it. Please make it. Every morning you'd have to cry. Find you sleepy ass. Icy slope. I can't read. I apologize. Every morning you find up this steep ass icy slope to get to class. Every day for like probably 260 or 70 days. Okay, probably more. Either way, it sucks. It's very cool. At least it was like, it sounds like a good hill that you had to climb, get your blood pumping. That way you're like fully awake for school. Or you're just extra tired for school. People fell all the time. I just imagine like um, what's that song called? I can't even do it, but it's whatever that one is. Trying to think about for remembrance. Keep thinking of Rodney Chesterfield, but that's Rodney. Um, no, that's an actor. The bug me, but whatever. Forgot about it. Super Bowl and everything just there's it what was it? I think it was two years ago or three. There was like a really bad cold snap. And like there was just ice on everything. It was freezing rain, that was what it was. And it was so much freezing rain that it knocked down like power lines. Trees were like bending over completely. Um just because there was so much weight on it. Yeah. Do you wish you remember this game better? Oh. Or you just cry. I did it! I got the thing. Gadgetron suck in and can vacuum up multiple enemies, then fire them out as high-caliber missiles. Caution, enemies must be small enough to fit inside the barrel. The very sucky. Yeah. That was, that was a bad time. And then there's a new thing that was called, it was called Ice Quakes. Open it. Yes. Ice Quakes, where it was so cold that it would cause like mini earthquakes. I didn't know that was a thing until it happened like a couple years. It's just, we're just the opposite. Which is so funny. When it goes 30, it's like, okay, everyone stay inside, emergency, emergency. But if it goes below freezing, it's just like, oh, uh, okay, just uh, step up your coat today. That's pretty much it. Freezing alone. Oh. You'll need a Gadgetron trespasser to get past this security door. Unfortunately, our scans do not show a trespasser available on this planet. Let's see where it is. 
they're like bringing your plants and your pebbles. Yeah. Something we gotta do is oh, bring in all the plants. They'll die. Also, I just remembered about your your pipes not being insulated. Also, Florida. I don't think your pipes are very close, deep enough that they're they're gonna freeze. Because here in Canada, you have to bury your pipes like five feet or lower outside to keep out of the frost line. If it's any lower than that, then it all freaks. Yeah, which planet I need to go? Okay, let's go here. No. But yeah, it's crazy shift in temperature. Okay, getting used to the buttons. To apologize. One. This one. Oh. This one. Yeah. Oh, like just actual groundwater. You know. That would be interesting. All that would freeze, like, got cold enough, all that would just turn to ice. I just hope. They live in Orlando. Yes. Okay. That's temperature, isn't it? Like, that's what the range is. Everything's built on swamp. Yeah, all that, like, depends on how much the, the water moves. If the water's, like, very stagnant, then that's just easier for it all to freeze. Oh, because they just sink into the swamp. And I imagine there's some houses that are on stilts and fuel. Oh, this guy. Come on, you can hit him. Good job. And make that draft. That's such. I mean, you should be your. Where, like, there's tall buildings all around. Also, hurricane. Yeah. Thankfully, we don't get those here. But. Yeah. No, oh, thank you. Cause then they can cause tidal, get tidal wave. Not a fun time. I've only seen one out of 13 years. 
Okay, that's not a bad ratio. Also, in one year, in 13 years, out one snowflake. Yeah, I think it's a very rare occurrence. If it ever snows, it. Like, it probably happened like a handful of times. I'm here. And then everyone will just be like, okay, stay at home morning, no one leave their house unless they need to. Damn, you lost power for the week in that hurricane? Also, I'm coming in. Going backwards and I can Maybe. Ah, ah. Ah, the wrong way to absorb your time. But oh, I'm a dumbass. Probably gonna do here. Their snow is worse. The area ahead of you can take. Yeah, honestly, to each their own. I can't say that it's not a nice idea to not have to ever shovel away your snow. But you don't just don't get it. Yeah, they can't really sell warm beer. They want to get rid of it as much as they can. You can use the. That's not bad. Like, pretty amazing, actually. Just select camera from the options menu. I wish there was a thing for like extremely snowy days where it's like alright it's gonna be too dangerous to drive for the next day or so so uh, come get your beer now grill everything in your fridge oh I can read yeah be like all right gotta get rid of this food now now or never 
Using the latest in precision laser technology, the Gadgetron Trespasser is guaranteed to work on Gadgetron's line of Invinso lock security doors. Oh. Alright, it was a block away. Lasers are mounted on each ring of the Invinso lock. Aim the lasers at the receptors on the outside ring to turn them green. All receptors must be green before the Invinso lock will open. Okay. Oh, you gotta... Use the left analog stick to control the trespasser. Push up and down to select which ring is active. Push left and right to rotate. Okay. It's a good time. I bet it is. That was amazing. Ears cheap. Barbecuing. Forces you to like. Because you need extra people to help eat all that food. So you get like gatherings and parties and stuff, and just brings everyone together more. Why did I? Oh, right. Got the press passer. Oh, no, I need down there. Let me get back to my ship. Yeah, that sounds amazing. I'd love to come, like go down there and get all once the world calms down. Definitely not want to live there or visit on like the super hottest of hot days. I kind of like the snow. Snow is poor to me, and I'm just do it. You never know my like. Of... I'm never leaving. Yeah, you do it. Yeah. Yeah, I can't say it. Right now, even we are doing super hot. We just came out of a lockdown. Oh, boy. Like, no small stores selling stuff but now they're just opened up again some places are still in lockdown because their numbers are going up but yeah it's what our pride premier wanted not but there's people that are still protesting saying no to masks and no to blocking true not spike if your numbers stay at steady level full time then then it's all the average and that's what people look at mostly come on i can do it a circle
Yeah, I don't, I don't know why people protest. Like, I can understand for the small businesses, because they would struggle to survive, and over 10,000 businesses have already, small businesses have closed down. I won't ever reopen because of it. But, uh, you gotta do what you gotta do to contain the virus. I can't. Or contain the spread of By double tapping the triangle button, you can quickly switch between your two most recently. Oh, you, now you tell me that game? Sure showed him. I suppose I did. Is your current occupation leaving a rotten taste in your mouth? Then you need to know about BTS, Blog Tactical Research Station. Hi, I'm Supreme Executive Chairman Drek, and we here at BTS are seeking motivated individuals to fill positions in these exciting careers. Grand Boot Tester. Warhead Assembly Technician, Mutant Animal Husbandry, Robot Repair Man, Suck Cannon Test Dummy, and Administrative Assistant. So call BTS. Build our weapons while you build your future. I'm calling BTS today. Now we're talking. Did you see all the cool gadgets they're making? Let's go get some. No, we must continue our search for Captain Quark. You're absolutely right. I am? Sure. We need to find Quark. Although when we find him, wouldn't it be nice to be able to tell him where Chairman Drek is? I suppose. Well, we go to the space station and talk to the scientists. They work for Drek, so they're bound to know where he is. I am unsure about your logic. Ah, uh, you think too much. Come on, let's go. So how to find Drek? And then work. And that won't be hell. But yeah, it hurts. I agree with you. So, like I said, there's people in here in Canada that will be the same way. Like, but they're all wearing the same hat, so. Oh. Oh. It was a super well planned Antiva attack. I got some great bargains for you today. Oh my god. Save. 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 Also, then we have crazy people about the, um, the new vaccine as well. Like, I tried to sabotage the, um, the witch McCall, the vaccine. Oh, I think it can get better. It just requires the people to work together towards the right thing could be 
station. Or the space station. Also, it matters a lot about the people in charge. The direction they truly want to go for their state. What workstation? some great bargains for you today proven and it's been put on so many people and like they test the crap out of it okay. so, uh, it's a joke where it's like a bunch of people are all asking for the vaccine we want the vaccine we want the vaccine and then the next panel is like a scientist showing the people like, here's the vaccine Story. That was too fast. rings it happens oh geez there's a keypad I can no you just <laughs> he's worried about all the things that it could do to his body and he asked people worried about it doing what and then I don't know Those all here. Okay. There we go. I don't know. He's forever. Your body like a temple. I agree. I can't be doing a whole bunch of crap that's gonna affect your body and then say you're worried about stuff, other stuff coming in and affecting your body. One that actually is all beneficial by a scientist. Okay. 
はいAnd hold the X button again while in the air to glide. But you hear that. Sounding okay. okay. This contortion is to have right now. Oh, whatever. Make what? Well, wouldn't say that. Do what you think is responsible. That is the best advice I can tell you. Moderation. Very good. Right there, right there, right there. And there. Pure. For 20, blaze it. Yeah. Either fortunate enough or unfortunate, depending on how you see it. Or how people see it. I've never really had a taste for alcohol. Okay. Sure, I'd have some at a party or something, but never a big fan of like drinking beer or alcohol. And I do really enjoy seeing it. an effort to make. The laziness keeps everything at that bay. That's true too. You have just activated a gadgetbot. To command a gadgetbot, hold down the triangle button and select wait, follow, attack, or enter. For all my little friends. That's true. Much different. That's the only time I ever really drank to with friends for social. Uh 
and insta drains using it you can drain and fill pools our sensors do not detect any on this space station okay why well, they had it in the yeah this is my speed they ain't faster Go back. We just opened up. Close that shortcut in case I die. Oh, there's no way this way. To the left. Well, I hope I can be of some enjoyment And I do enjoy talking Nice and chill Fun okay. Get up there Dingus on the wrong way. Floundering about. The permanent, a good speed run of this game is to fail. Turn to Russia. I'm back. So you are. And I found this. Hey, cool. It's a, uh, uh, what is it? A hydro displacer. Great. I always wanted one of those, I guess. Did you yeah. know you can place any gadget or weapon on your quick select? Just pause and choose quick select from the menu. Price. Oh, okay. Interesting. So if in like if I'm in a pinch, like I can't hold. Not why. I can't hold triangle. Is it? That was a collectible. 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 
Thank you, Randy, for all your good. I got some great bargains for you today. I like that voice actor. That's not guys voice. Left to play. Pretty camera. I guess so. Okay, this shuttle has an autopilot which will take you to a decommissioned Mark warship. Our scanners indicate that there may be useful technology on board. It's okay. Bombs are like the best weapon to drop in. Captain here. What the hell are you? Okay. Oh, oh, okay. No, no, I don't want to see the captain. Oh, shit. I'm gonna need it. Oh. I'm an idiot. I really like this game. It's like you don't have to think too hard. Yeah, okay, it's got the platforming and the fun. The fun and the platforming and, and the ooh, ooh. And the killing and the funny line. But I gotta remember to save. And then lower than probably want to do this part over. Shiny button, I should say. 
Thank you for selecting our automated self-destruct feature. Vessel yeah. annihilation sequence initiated. Please remove all personal belongings. Oh, gee. Alright. No, not today, boys. Can't play today. Alright, can't play. No, no flying today, sorry. In a matter of seconds. Please and evacuate. Bada bang, bada boom. So for your birthday, you got... A second. For your birthday, you got 830 game expansion for your Sega Genesis. The way you felt when you beat Toy Story for the first time ever after 25 years. Genesis Mini. Oh. Oh, that's pretty cool. I didn't know that they came out with them. The 813 games. Jeez. Gotta be like all of them. This is Darla Gratch reporting live from Blackwater City. We've just learned that Captain Quark will be presenting the grand prize at the Intergalactic Hoverboard Championship, which will be held here over the next few days. In related news, this planet has recently been suffering from an infestation of strange amoeboid creatures. The city's administration has assured this reporter that every step has been taken to eradicate these nuisances. Darla Gratch, Channel 2 News. Did you see that? Yes, I hope that poor woman is all right. Ah, uh, she's mm. fine, I think. I was talking about the hoverboard races. Oh, it's still missing about 200 it. Jeez, there's so many Sega Genesis games. what I got for my SNES Classic. It's like the same idea and triggers sort of like the same yeah, same idea, just different company. Oh no. I don't know what No! No! But uh So far. That's amazing still. The thing with my the SNES Mini can't do that. Doesn't have the well, my can't do that. Doesn't have the expansion, so I can I can put on about what is it, 140 games or so, and any more they'll start to cause slowdown in these years. And... Yeah. Need a little help with these enemies. That's pretty amazing. Got a lot of games to play. Into that. Any game um, you plan on beating next? Or are you just been going through like the different style, like trying out different games? Yeah, I'd say for most consoles, I think personally the newer game, new generation games, like every generation of video game console just came out with more garbage or shovelware. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. Revenge of the Shinobi. Throwing shurikens and ninja stars. Placing people real fast. Okay. Oh, there we go. Got 32 bits. Graphics. I think. Or is that the. Or is it? Oh, that's set. Kind of. Other two bits. Of amazing graphics. No, no, this crappy SNES or Atari Master System. Or Sega Master System. I mean. That's what I got. Or my dad. an idiot I apologize everyone sound oh there's no way to make it brighter there's no brightness option just super dark in here so it's hard for no reason. Gotta be some reason. I would imagine. I couldn't. Ending worth it? But like, thank you so much. You saved the day. And then shows like them all hugging or something. That's good that you beat or oh you didn't beat it yet. Sorry. I was reading it as like past tense, so I thought you thought you did beat it. But um Yeah. Oh really? You thought your dad beat it when the young lad? Those are always pretty fun to play. It's a nostalgic game that you remember from your childhood. Now you're stepping up and you're gonna beat it. Is 
least you know it's beatable. Which is super crazy hard. Jump you fool. Stages. I probably should have done. And which stage have you gotten to? I gotta think more about it. One, this is a Just the tough part. That was just me being dumb and hit the ball. Give me the chain. Give me the chain. You can do it. Apparently, you can without me having to help. Here we go. I mean to 
just stand on that box. Oh, what? These are her little babies? Big mama. He was a big mama. Making little baby toes. Oh, there was how fair with the fish. I was a goner this time. Some nano wit in genetics must have left the cages open again. You could come down now. Honestly, a gadget engineer deserves a bit more respect, if you ask me. So, you are an inventor. Gadget engineer. I create revolutionary devices for Executive Chairman Drek. For instance, Viola. My soon-to-be-patented grind boots. Look, I, I, I need to get out of here so I can find a new job. How about I sell you these? At cost. Sell? After we just saved your scrawny butt? All right, all right. I'll give you the employee discount, too. Without, okay. Well, Guess thanks. I can I'm going to get out of here while I still can. I'll scrounge by, I guess. You've got the grind boots. Grind boots let you travel on rails like this. Just jump onto the rail and grind. Fine, you know. Like we in the club, just grind. There would be a tram. Cool. And boots are good times. I was like grinding levels. Okay, got all that. New mission. Everything is complete. EP again. Audi. Hi there, Fuzzball. Oh, that's a nice one. Put on ammo. Put on ammo. Oh, that's a nice one. I'm always good. I'm good on bomb and low ammo. Got the weapons we wanted. Fudge out. When the hoverboard, oh my god, we're gonna get the hoverboard. Yes, please. I am so down to hoverboard. Near. 
planet real bad. Pretty busy planet. Hi there, Fuzzball. Finally. That's a real beauty. Well, looks like it's mine. Love now. <laughs> oh, everyone just laughed. Oh. Driver, what is that? There we go. Don't shoot your green goo at me. Oh, it's a big tank. Oh, it's a goo tank. Say Wu Tang? No, I, uh, I don't know what I said that would make you think Wu Tang. Not saying they're not bad though. I should have. Oh, bang! Oh, time! That's bad. No, don't stop doing me in the face. Need to, need to go here. Up we go. I like their little high pitch boys. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, that's not good. Oh, 
at downtown. Boxes. What if I want to just keep going this way? Oh, I can't keep going this way. All right, to downtown we go. Don't forget about that bowl. Head back. Head downtown. Doesn't feel very safe. Don't you make the game of your henchmen. You're just dodge crossing for it. You're making shady deals the whole time. You know what? And I that is the time of games to be today. doing that. Like, that would be a good indie game. I don't see it as a, like a good old game back in the day, but nowadays I think it would be pretty, pretty decent. And you could like modify your hench person. Oh, Nikki sends a gun. You modify your hench person so that they can have like one hunchback or a double hunchback and stuff. Right. Here, have this. Plus 120 sneak. Lever pulling. Oh, you look like a freaky dude. Are you friend or foe? You look like I friend. I know for you, robot. Treat you. Well, okay, ratchet. <laughs> I'm kidding. Sorry, he's not for sale. What's a rhino anyway? Rip ya a new one. What did you just say to me? R Y N O. Rip ya a new one. Why, that's the most powerful missile launcher in the galaxy. I know it's worth a lot of bolts. He must have stolen it from the Blar. Stolen? Look, trash can. Did I say anything about him being hot? You better watch your mouth or I'll... Wait, don't tell me. Rip you a new one. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. That's a lot of bolts. I need 150,000. Okay, and that ain't touching. Open. Thanks, Mr. Cameraman. Thank you, helps a lot. Oh, 
Ooh. Damn, it's got the drop on me. There we go. Thank you, my precious. Oh, there's still bad guys so that you can't see? Okay, nothing new. Lots of bullets though. Okay. There's health up there, so I want to go up there real quick. Also, those babies come in handy. Real nice. So I see they don't last too long. So I wasn't paying attention that you can stand on the mantle fly up. I should have known. But I was a fool. How out of here? I know. Also, I should have stayed on that side and. I need one golden bolt. I didn't know I needed one. I thought there was a bonus extra stuff. Golden bullet somehow. Here, one more. 
course, though. Also, Jesus, camera is always looking backwards from where I need to, like, go. Driving nuts. Behind here. Oh my goodness, I gotta go open. Open, um, open. Oh, my dreams. They came crashing down so so gotta get in there somehow. Can't do anything there yet. I think there's supposed to be a certain point in the game where I'm like, okay now I can go after the golden bullets or bolts. to the Hovercon Intergalactic Hoverboard Competition. Captain Quark's giving away a brand new Platinum Zoomerator to the winner of this competition. A Platinum Zoomerator? Hmm. Perhaps that will be the proof of your accomplishments that Skid's agent requires. Wait, do you guys mean Skid McMarks? Yeah, Skid couldn't make it, so we're here to, you know, fill in for him. Guess we'll see about that. All right. I gotta go take another look. I apologize. Poor weapon. to go through this race or after I collect some more bullets.
break that. I need to find something that upgrades my range from switching pot. My range for picking up bullets and nuts. That's what I'm trying to say. Can this race be hard enough that I'm gonna save? Boop, 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 boop. Bing. I'm so not used to the top button being. Speed up. Jeez, then. <gasps> Don't. Oh, jeez. Jerry's. Jerry's the last one. Oh, I can't do that for you. Like finish the race already today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just the race. Try that again. Dang it. Look, kids, don't ever read and drive. It's just dangerous. All right. Oh, that's right, I gotta move the stick left and right to get points. Crap. Oh, hello. Oh, give me it. I was trying to show off and I was holding back by like a door. Damn it. It was so good. And then so bad. At least it gives you like a very quick. Hey, you want to retry? Okay, here you go. Oh, 
out of the way, out of the way, punks. Oh, that's not gonna end well. Ah, oh, fourth place. Jeez, we'll burn. I was holding. Oh, damn it! It's hold, it's push the buttons, isn't it? To do um, the trick. Whatever. Oh, matter. Oh, oh, oh God! Jeez, this ain't easy. The fundamentals. Fundamentals of PlayStation 2 games. Thank you. 
I gotta stop jumping off of it. Hi folks, Captain Quark here. It is my distinct pleasure to introduce this year's Hovercon Intergalactic Champions. Let's give it up for newcomers. Ratchet and Clank. Hey, look, that's us. Today's winners will take home a brand new professional grade model T15 Platinum Zoomerator. Ooh. Manufactured by Gadgetron, this hoverboard drive delivers more lift, speed, and maneuverability than any other anti-grab device on the market. Well, folks, that's all the time we have tonight. Remember to set your info bots to the Quark Classic channel for tonight's episode of Dogfight Over Death Canyon. Starring yours truly. Thank you and have a Quark-tastic day. Quark-tastic day. You want a platinum zoomerator? Oh yeah, I'm good enough. Good enough for the guy. I'm good enough to prove to the agent. Not good enough to fight these guys. Ah, oh, I didn't open up over there. Get over there, looks like you go there. Yeah. Did the ship just. Chip, 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 chip. What a hustle and bustle in town. That's why there's a huge gap to look on the map. Didn't mean to rhyme there, but it came in perfect time. There. Okay. Some nuts and bolts. Nuts and bolts. Forgetting to hit the thing. The god is in fact. What is this?
here. Okay. get to her. My says that doesn't that doesn't go anywhere. Pardon me. Nice. Oh. Turn. If you equip the hydro displacer, you'll be able to use the insta faucets in this area. Is I not using? Pleasure. As the hydro is equipped. Okay. So it's not on there. Oh, it's the thing that I gotta actually like, push in the forehead. Set it to a hot kick where I'm gonna have to build the map every time. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, what? Oh, my underwater bitch. But it helps pad the game. Makes you spend some time in the air. Going after me. This 
way. So back up. I do like soundtrack. Game. Oh, come on. Thanks. That would be. Also, I appreciate when you're running out of air, it's not like a. Like, like a annoying, stressful beat. It goes super fast, like. Dee, 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 dee. Okay there. You don't know? Trey ain't my work pay, I guess. That was a little hairy. Ah, oh, come in. Oh, good, we're outside. It's going so fine now. Oh, it's the opposite. Open the gate before I do. is over. Captain Quark don't want no more reporters bugging him in his trailer. Oh, you see, my friend and I need to speak to the captain about a matter of galactic security. 
You mean you and your walking camera? You paparazzi make me sick. Now beat it. But sir, I'm sure the Captain Quark won't understand once we. Now, now save it. I know how it works. You convince me to let you in. You snap a picture of the captain in his underpants. Underpants. Then you sell a picture to the info tabloid for a million volts. You've got it all wrong. Meanwhile. I'm stuck here making six bolts an hour, and I have to listen to a lecture from that cheapskate quark. So you don't get in unless I get a kickback. In advance. I need about 4,000 bolts. Also. Okay, I was just wasn't sure where that taxi is. Drive him. You see how it works. You grease the hinges, the door opens. Uh, trap Captain it. Quark. What's that? It's Ratchet and Clank, oh. Captain. You know, from the hub. Oh, yes, yes, I know who you are. You do? Yes, and thank the galaxy you found me. Huh? There's an awful plot being hatched to destroy our planet. Oh, no. Ratchet, he knows. Great. Oh, Does that mean we can go hoverboarding now? My oh, friends, okay. we're all in grave danger. And I believe that together, we can put a stop to this madness. Together? You mean you want our help? Look, Ratchet, I've been keeping an eye on you. And I've never seen anyone with such raw talent. Such a drip. You are a true hero in the making. Really? You mean I could be famous? Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Oh, here, take this. Oh, another video bot. What makes one man toil in obscurity while another becomes a hero? Is it strength, compassion, determination, or just pure blind luck? Wise men through the ages have struggled with that very question, but Captain Quark knows the secret. That's why he's been able to defeat more despots, rescue more damsels in distress, and save more civilizations than any other hero in the galaxy. Now is your opportunity to see if you've got the stuff heroes are made of. This infobot contains coordinates to Quark's secret base. Can you quickly conquer Quark's killer cannonade of confounded contraption? Can you quickly quark? Can can you quarkly quit? Oh, just make your way through the defenses to the center of the base. Prove yourself, learn the secret, and earn your place in galactic history. Consult your doctor before attempting any strenuous exercise. Not responsible for death or dismemberment. Your results may vary. Quarky quarkly quarky of course. Meet me at. Uh, uh. Meet me at my headquarters. Hey, Captain Ratchet, what do you think? We won't fail you, sir. We promise. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, all missions completed. Yahoo! Keeping that. Keeping that real. Oh, you can't get off until you get caught. Interesting. Oh. Alright, and we go. We go, bro. Quark's H kill in Umbra. Or on Umbra. Five his bone flitch. Man's been thrown down. Planet Umbra. Well, here. I Challenge course. Now is your chance to prove yourself strong and brave, like me. <laughs> Conquer it, and you'll join in my fight against evil. Haven't we done enough already? What? I can't hear you. I said, haven't we done? Sorry, still having trouble. Tell me later. Later? We might be dead by then. What? All right, Clank, let's get going. Nice. I'm sure this quirk is. 
I got some great bargains for you today. Doesn't care about saving anybody anything. That's a real beauty. That's a real beauty. Um, um. That's a real that's beauty. Wait. Always have stocked up. Love of doom. Save my butt in a pinch. So my butt don't get pinched. Difficult as the game goes on. Or, I guess, jumping puzzles. And more than. And her. Oh. Gotcha. Defenses are useless against me. My wrench is overpowering. Plaster. I got some great bargains for you today. Oh. All the way. 
I know what I need. Oh, yeah. frowning now. But I'm sure I go around somehow. Sounds like a mine ready to go on. One more, one there. Oh, 
think I got hit by the easiest dodgeable thing. I would have been pretty embarrassing. Thanks so much for the follow, Agent Joseph. I'm but appreciate it. How are you doing? Follow as well. Like when. Nice little touch if they had it. Okay. Ready. Boom. Not ready to figure out where there it is. Get that stuff. What is that open? Oh, no, no. Oh, okay. Over. Hey. Should have jumped earlier. Okay, 
aquí. What's this up here? Oh, oh man. Why am I wasting that? So much more efficient. So oh, works. Plus, no longer efficient. the deadly Alps. She the test of arm strength right here. Good to know. Good to know. Okay, there's virtually a little enough friggin' pull you out. Straight up murder. going wrong way
boost the water. Different than the other. Got water. All clear. Head up. So it's all good. That's okay. Jump. I can do it. Oh, my leg. to range please I'm not sure I'm gonna have to like face a big modern fish thing thing Ha ha ha, 
that. Come on, gadget power. The little gadget. Blaster ammo. It's almost done it, folks. Some of his course. Then we get to tell him what's wrong with like what's going on in the galaxy. Be peasy. Well, well, you two continue to surprise me. Step into the ring of heroes, and I will finally give you what you deserve. Ratchet, this is no time for you to become cautious. We have reached our goal. I don't know. There's something fishy going on here. Listen to your little metal friend, Ratchet. Your destiny is mere steps away. It's just something doesn't seem right. This is it. Quark is going to help us stop Cheb and Drek. Why, thank you, Clank. You've been most helpful. Get off of me, you idiot! <laughs> I love it when a plan comes together! What do you mean? What do you think he means, genius? He's not gonna help us, he's gonna kill us! You catch on quick. Although there is one problem with your hypothesis. I'm not going to kill you. You're not? No. He is. Oh, the big boy. But why? But why? It's really not that difficult to decipher. I'm the official spokesman for Drek's new planet. I can't have you two getting in the way of my comeback. This isn't over, Quark. No. But it will be soon. Oh. oh. Wow. <laughs> yeah, very stompy lad. Something I can go ahead. Oh, he's close. Ah, fuck it. Frog, you get your cold deeper. Oh. 
like a scrub In the lava you go. get around them. the galaxy and warn everyone. I wonder what that info bot is for. Maybe it can replace you. We're pinned down! We're pinned down! The ships are hammering our position from the air! That was a little too close! We need support! Now! Our Actually, I need support! 
My entire battalion went AWOL and left me to fight this war on my own. If the enemy doesn't kill those guys, I will. I'm not gonna last much longer. Request an immediate assistance. Over and out. Those are direct okay. ships destroying that planet. We must help that commando. Are you serious? That's it. I am out of here. Captain Quark is gonna be sorry he messed with me. This is not about Captain Quark anymore. There are innocent lives being lost. Yeah? Well, I'm done with this stupid hero stuff. I got my own agenda now. Ratchet, this is not like you. What do you know about me? You've spent this whole time looking for Quark. You don't know anything about me. I know that you will do the right thing. Well, right now, the thing I want to do is find Quark. How do you start this stupid thing? Have you forgotten? You need a robotic ignition system. I will start the ship if you agree to help that commando. So, blackmail is it? Fine. Just shut up and start the ship. Elsewhere aboard Supreme Executive Chairman Drex flagship. Back so soon? Oh, you're talking to me. I'm not in the habit of talking to myself, you buffoon. Did you get rid of them? Yes! No. Well, I, I had this plan, and I thought... You thought? You thought? I do the thinking around here, you slug brain idiot! I simply needed you to eliminate those two nuisances before they could cause any real trouble! But I wanted to... Do you still want to be the highly paid spokesman for my planet? Yeah. Then the next time I send you to do a job, I want results! Now get out of my sight! Planet Italia. Add attention, you deserting maggots! The next time you soldiers try to go AWOL, I'll shoot you myself! Look, I just wanna zip it, worm! You see those bombers? If you don't get to the turrets and knock those ships out of the sky, this whole planet's gonna be rubble! Meet me at the city entrance! He needs our help. Yeah? Why don't you go help him? Into another trap? Well, go on. Go fight some evil. <laughs> At least I'm not a coward. Whatever. As soon as I find Quark, I'm selling you for scrap. Oh no. Trouble. Their friendship's in trouble. Oh, what do you know? Hi there, Fuzzball. I was staying. Want what? No. That's a real beauty. Just got enough. This looks good. Right nice. here. Click select. Oh, crap. Out the area commando at the city. Oh, me. Oh, okay. So, like, 
extra area, I'll take it. Oh, that's rails. That's a rail. What? How was... Damn it. It was on it, but I hit it one too many times. Halt! Who are you? What are you doing? We are on a mission to save the galaxy. Speak for yourself and put your hands down. You look ridiculous. Actually, I don't care who you are. I've got to get the heck out of here. I joined the army to get money to go to college. I never knew I'd end up in a war. Go figure. This is a noble cause, sir. Noble my Jaime. I just want to get home to my family. Here, I pulled this off a busted robot. Give me some bolts for bus fare and it's yours. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Not okay. Hi there, Fuzzball. Dang it. to find one all covered Thank you. 
Okay, so I need to get that metal one. Okay, then I can work my way out. Does it not exist? Okay, there it is. I've like gone around this thing. Find a couple green. I had to get them all like the same. Oh, no. The ones that are thinking. I was just getting them. This has some. They gotta just get. Okay. That guy was dire. Was dire. Guys got him out. Oh, 
it's not fine. And now we can buy. Oh, I'm sorry. I gotta do it. Oh, I got me. Ah, oh, flip me. Never see that person coming. Oh. oh, hey, Cobalt. Thanks for the lurk. I appreciate it, man. I hey, don't hit the oh, hope is all is well. Just a loop to loop. Hacha, one more hacha. No, oh, oh there. Thanks a bunch. Good luck saving the galaxy or whatever. Greetings, Supreme Executive Chairman Drek. As you can see, we're about to test our newest automated pilot's helmet. This helmet allows pilots to control our latest high-tech pilots using only their thoughts. Please enjoy the demonstration. We still have a, a few minor adjustments to make. I'm gonna survive. Wow. If they ever get the kinks worked out of that thing, I have got to get me one of those. If they are working for Chairman Drek, they may know where he is. Is that all you can think about? Drek this and Drek that? I got my own problems. If you cannot see the importance of this situation, you do have problems. Yeah? Well, if you're so smart, how come you fell for Quark's stupid trick? Oh, ah, forget thing. it. We both need to get to this planet, and that's all that matters. This is a step back. Oh, these aren't friendly. 
I thought they were just, I don't know, droids flying around with lights on them. Hiding under the ground. Stop it. Where are you? Ah, there you are. Zero health. Oh, she. Have to get thing on the inside of it. Oh, it's just all right. 
kind of need. Where's the waste? down there? No. Looks... I don't know, was it anything? Okay, where'd you go, buddy? Oh, you're in these bushes somewhere. To know, good to know. Oh, jeepers, creepers. Technically, I was, but now that guy came after me. Sort of secret over here. Oh, secret, secret. Found a secret. Gold, gold acquired. Save, save. Okay, bye. Yes. I have to go that whole way.
we got another big ass tank. I'm already just perks up and up. I know there's one more over here. Okay. Huh? There you go. A half a bridge. And we got the other half. PG. Frickin' scurry. Green steps. Yeah. Oh, it's great. This is some sort of trick. That thing and won't budge. I've tried everything I know short of nuclear weaponry. Hmm. No, never mind. Well, you tried. See ya. Not so fast, soldier. You're going into that compound even if I have to throw you. Aha! That ventilation shaft leads to the turret platform. Soldier, find a way to use that shaft to infiltrate the compound undetected. Hmm. You've shown bravery by making it this far, soldier. And for that, I reward you. I intercepted this communique that you might find useful. Take it. I'm off to find my battalion. Good luck. Hello once again, fellow blog. I hope this message finds you well. As many of you know, our home planet is no longer habitable. We've abandoned our factories, our laboratories, and our happy lives because of the encroaching pollution, leaving much behind. Fortunately, the nearby planets will supply us with all we need to create our new home, which is nearing completion. Once our scientists locate the ideal orbit, our new world will be perfect. So reserve your space now. Prime locations are filling up fast. Good day. Now do you understand why we must stop him? He won't rest until he has destroyed every planet in the galaxy. Yeah? Well, I got bigger fish to fry. Bigger than the galaxy? Well, different fish anyway. Look, didn't that commando guy say we could get into that compound? Yes, by using the ventilation shaft. But we will need something special to walk on that. Fine, let's get going then. We'll come back later. You will need a pair of Gadgetron magnets to traverse this ventilation shaft. Unfortunately, our scanners do not detect any magna boots on this planet. Alright. Let's go to a place with magna boots. Push the wrong one. You will need a pair of Gadgetron Magna Boots right, to traverse now. this ventilation shaft. Unfortunately, okay. our scanners do not detect any Magna Boots on this planet. Oh, I'm not quite sure what happened. I know what would happen there. Up 
this giant squirrel. Run jumps. Park refinery. Search laboratory. I have helmet. Okay. You know what? Let's find that pilot's helmet. Go into the Blark Depot. Find the pilot's helmet. Let's stop. Stop and call it now. Panic. Yeah.
Okay, 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 okay. Honey. Let's connect all the precious money. This one just auto lets you in, while the other ones you had to push a triangle. In. Use the bomb. What is wrong with the bomb?
I told I had a Let's take him. Oh, take him very, very. First, that's the weapon. Game arrived so you can avoid the disaster of yesterday's stream. Oh, it wasn't that bad. I just I fell asleep because it was so early in the morning. But I would have stayed on if I wasn't tired. Doors. The way you know it works. We'll fall into the pasta there. Oh, I said don't fall off. Oh my. This is where they got the idea of all the Lego games where you build, where you collect studs. I think they got that idea from this. That one even sounds the same. Or at least to me it does. So those 
Still, love a doom ammo thing for amazing. Look at all these guys, so even trying. Oh, ho, 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 ho. for new weapons and boys someone's gonna be like hey I'll sell this to you but you need 50 bajillion coins for the spaceship. That's it. Okay. I forgot I had that one. Oh, I switched it. There's the helmet. Oh, in the open. Perfect. But yeah, I like the, the dialogue. It's pretty funny. Spaceship anywhere now? Just in case. It's a helmet. That lets me fly my spaceship with my thoughts. Helmet. Where are all these standing questions? First of all, I need to buy. Hi there, Fuzzball. Yes, please. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, that's a nice one. Actually. Dude. Oh, it's a big punch. I don't know how to say 
this for it. Server. this happen oh bye bye no fuel for you My butt. thing to blow up. Pushing the wrong one. Damn it. That is it. I had to be up there and do it. I guess. That would make sense. Yeah, die, die. Yeah. Very sticky. So good. Here, let's talk to mom. This way. That is my. Oh, 
Oh, we're back there. Let's thing is. Chest, 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 chest. Hello, chest, 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 chest. Yeah, yeah, you're lazy but streamy, doctor. Got a, a plethora of games to play. Oh, you can just take a shower and then you can stream. Hello, Jess. I hope you're doing well. Um. like Ratchet and Clank. I've never played it. Always coming up with excuses. Oh, okay. Okay, that again. Wow, that's failure. Uh, my daycare. Is that why you're always here, Dr. Mug? Need someone that I can look after you. Make sure you're okay. God. Flam, flam. Also, I went the wrong. Oh, god damn. Bingo. I did the same thing here. Let me go back. It's my last try, and then I actually gotta go to bed because it is like three in the morning. That's a late time. Over there. I can play a little bit longer because Dr. Moggs needs time to clean up his stickiness. See you on stream. When they suck. <gasps> From su God damn it. Get out of here. Bossy. Baby. Alright. Got a nice 
Ace DJB. Are we talking? Go for me. What does it even mean? I have to scroll. Okay. Well, oh, don't leave with that one. What is this? like all game for like five hours and we're home Bice. and the pilot's on Bicer is this there we the helmet I don't quite what it does Bye. 
good, right? All right. Oh, on that car. Is there even anyone on? Raid. Is there anybody out there? I could raid Dr. Moggs if he starts streaming. Dr. Moggs, you want to start streaming? Hello. All right, you go start streaming, then I can turn this off. Two minutes. All right. What can we do for two minutes? See where we gotta go next time. Search for the laboratories. Or Oxon. Or Zon. Like it. Yes. I wanna thank all you amazing people out there for coming by, watch my stream. Appreciate it. You're all amazing people. All right, five more minutes. Jeez, Dr. Moggs, these people are not just gonna wait around for that long. They got busy things to do. Thanks, Salmic. I don't, I'm not sure how much you saw, but I hope you enjoyed it. Oh, sorry, I misread your, your message. For the eighth time in five minutes. That makes more stream more sense. Also, I want to thank so much Agent yeah, Agent Joseph Two for the follow and catch a ride for following in between in between uh streams. Appreciate it. Oh, wonderful people. And hopefully you can come by and watch the rest of this. I have to play Half-Life 2 next. Dr. Bong wants to see Half-Life 2, apparently. All right. Come on. Which? BS. Yes. This is overall has been a really fun game. I've been liking it a lot. Like the puzzles, they're not really hard, but still feel gratified beating them and beating the robots and all the funny lines and certain directions they went with in the cutscenes that were pretty good. Yeah, I look forward to playing in it again. Wonder how we stop track. Work. Will we make it in time? Can we do it? You, okay, you ready? So I. Okay, I'll just preemptively type it. Because it doesn't say you're on yet. Oh, wrong way. I am
Oh. Oh my god, it's been a fucking result. <clears throat> my my French. Oh, bleeding hell. Yeah, let me get the full. Now poison. Don't poison your body with this crap. Look at that. Oh, bloody hell. Sorry about the crappy music. I was like, Spotify, do you want to play some music? And he's like, ah, but you're watching it on your television. I'm like, no, it's not. My television's bloody turned off. And I've got to put my, my special magic... Can I hear myself? I can hear myself through Mike's vibes. You turn off, you on.